hi developers so this is the last part of our application and here we will clone our project from github and run on the local system we can start with the points so as i told you like first of all we have to just clone our project from git then we will install the packages with npm install command then we will run our project with the server and uh, for that keep in mind that guys uh, json server uh, must have to install in your system and uh, if you did not install then let me just give you the video link so guys here you can see that uh, this is the sixth video and uh, this is all about like how we can install json server how it's work and all so you have to install the json server also right and uh, then we will test like everything working fine or not so now i am jumping on my github repository even the link is also given in the description box but again uh, i just want to show you like uh, i have around 71 repositories on my github account and uh, there is all code is present there whatever code i am writing for myself or any uh, anything for learning or maybe for uh, just writing code for uh, any kind of video so i just put all uh, comments uh, code there right for example my angular code is there uh, before that i created a react redux with api series so the project is there uh, and one more thing uh, database with js uh, data structure with js is also there so all my code is available here if you just want to check it out there then you can just uh, bookmark it and you can follow me uh, on github also all right and uh, after that let's clone our project from there and to clone your project again what, what you need you need a uh, git bash in your system so if you are using windows then uh, let me show you git bash is mandatory in your system otherwise you can directly uh, download the zip file and uh, run the npm command inside that right so what i'm going to do now i'm just copying the link of this uh, repository just clone it and uh, i'm creating a one more folder on my dashboard so let's say my folder name is uh, project demo or something and inside it i am just opening a command line and putting there git clone and uh, this is my uh, repository link so now you can see that project is cloned there and uh, now we don't need this command line again let's open this folder now you will find all files expect one thing which is node modules and that we have to install now so just open again npm uh, and just write here npm install and it will just take a bit uh, bit of time because uh, uh, npm install actually really heavy and they are just installing now so though they'll just take some time and within that time what i'm going to do i'm just opening a one more command line there uh, from here and i'm running my json server so i'm putting json server hyphen hyphen watch db dot json right and this is really lightweight this is really kick start so this is uh, just uh, working now and i'm waiting to for just installing the npm modules and after that uh, we will check this is how this is working or not all right node modules are now installed and now uh, we can just run the ng serve command to run it on our local system let's again wait for a moment all right guys so code is also compiled now what we can do we can open a uh, incognito mode so that there, there will be no issue for cache and local storage and all and just simply run here localhost 4200 right so here we have all product data because this is present already inside the uh, db.json file right so now what we can do uh, let's say uh, you just want to log in any user and uh, let's say you want to log in anil at the rate user abc123 is the password and I'm just clicking on the login. And now let's say I just want to add uh, by two uh, Samsung M40 mobile. So I just put them in cart. And uh, after that, let's say I just want to uh, Nike shoes also. Again, I just put them in a cart. And after that, uh, here you can see that this is a detail. And let's say I just uh, change my mode and I don't want to buy, let's say shoes, right? And I just remove them. And you can see that price is still fine and now i am just checking it out and after that it will ask uh, me to just add the address so i am just adding anil at the rate 
test.com email address and uh, some random address with some random mobile number and clicking the order now and you can see that cart is empty order has been placed you can see that green message and now we have uh, three orders two order are placed previously as i told you like data is already present in the db.json file because this file is also there right and now let's say you just want to log out right and you can just simply click over there and again let's say you want to create a new user now right so just click on the create new user and create let's say you want to create a dummy user right and the email address is also let's say demo at the rate test.com password is abc123 and just click on the sign up user is logged in and uh, you can buy let's say you just to buy iphone 14 uh, you just click over there just go to the cart just click to buy the product and you can add some address like demo at the rate user and uh, address is let's say again sector 17 ida and mobile number is double date double nine or something whatever again you can see that order is done cart is empty and here you can see that one order is placed if you want to place one more order then you can do with the same way let's say you just want to buy we already purchased that so let's say now that time you want to buy shoes just uh, add one quantity and uh, now just check out and some address let's say address is again no or something double nine double nine just clicking on the order now order has been done and this is the total amount to pay now you can see that we have the two orders there so that's all for this guys and let's say you want to just cancel one order then you can just cancel it also right so that's all for this part if you still have any kind of query any question you can ask me in the comment box and thank you so much for watching this uh, video and uh, i will request you uh, to subscribe my channel like this video and share your feedback in comment section thank you guys